In this tutorial, we'll be covering the multi-channel sharing widget. Now, this is essentially a tool that you can put onto your website or different websites to allow users to interact with your chatbot in a number of different ways. I'll show you how to set it up and how to implement it. First, select My Bots from the left-hand menu. Then select the chatbot that you wish to work with. In this case, HealthBud. Next, select Channels from the left-hand menu and Web Chat. Then select Share This Bot from the top right corner. Now, there's a number of things that you can do here. For example, first in the settings, you can customize the message that will display in the bubble that pops up. You can also set it to display the email address, the SMS address, or in this case, I've chosen to show the different channels that you can chat with here. You can also change through your different icons. I have the bot avatar set, but and I can do Snatchbot logo, chat, phone, all depending on what I need. And down here, you can see the preview of what it's going to look like. So how do you actually bring it to your website? For an example, let's use my Wix website. From there, select add, section to page, We'll give that a second to load and we'll select HTML embed and then one of these templates. Now, while this loads, I'm going to go back and I'm going to grab two snippets of code. With that first one, I'm going to go back and select the HTML. And I'm going to clear out what's in there. And I'm going to paste in that first snippet. I'm going to go back and grab the second. And I'm going to drop that in as well. Now we'll let that load. As you can see, I have my bubble popped up. And if we preview it, Just taking a few moments here and I select it, then you can connect and use that. And as you can see, now you can get started and talk with your web chat. So you can see this is a very powerful way to be able to share your chatbot. It's extremely flexible and can fit the needs of basically anywhere on your website you need, depending on space. So that's all for this tutorial and it should have you well on your way to getting your multi-channel widget sharing widget set up.